there has been little research into how chiropractic care can impact children's overall quality of life. Quality of life QOL surveys are often given in healthcare to give insight into the mental status of people. These surveys often report on aspects of mental status such as anxiety, depression, fatigue, and or pain interference. It is important to not only look at individuals from a musculoskeletal perspective, but to assess them as a whole, physically and mentally. A chiropractic research study published in the Journal of Alternative and Complementary Medicine in 2018 found that the quality of life of children improved following chiropractic care as measured by a survey called the Patient Reported Outcomes Measurement Information System, or PROMISE. This suggests that the children under chiropractic care may have an improved QOL with improvements in physical functioning and mobility, anxiety, depressive symptoms, fatigue, peer relationships, and pain following a trial of chiropractic care. The research study was conducted by Dr. Joel Alcantara and colleagues, taking information from 63 chiropractors in a practice-based research network, PBRN, involving 881 children with an average age of 12.5 years and 881 parents. The parents were given a survey to provide socio-demographic information, their experience with chiropractic care, and motivation for seeking care. The pediatric survey was a PROMISE 25 questionnaire, which has 25 items assessing different domains of physical, psychological, and social health and overall quality of life. On average, there were 38 days and 2.7 patient visits between the baseline pediatric QOL survey and the post-care survey. There are three main reasons why this research is important. First, this study gave insight into when and why parents seek chiropractic care for their children. For almost half of the parents in the study, the main motivation was in seeking wellness care. Next, the overall findings are based on the chiropractors having used a variety of different techniques, suggesting that the specific technique used did not directly impact the results. This helps to establish external validity of the PROMISE 25 study for use in chiropractic. Finally, this study shows that under chiropractic care, children can not only experience the typical musculoskeletal improvements, but also improvements psychologically and in their overall quality of life. The PROMISE 25 can be easily included with existing procedures and paperwork in chiropractic offices. Wider use of this questionnaire could contribute to the insights of the impact of chiropractic on children, both physically and mentally.